Your eyes perceive something. You're good. So your eyes perceive something, your brain receives a message and creates a picture, and then your body reacts to what it thinks the picture is. Mm -hmm. Right. So the key is you gotta make damn sure the picture's right. Okay, well, the picture that I've always had, or I had it for years, I have it now, I didn't have it through my whole playing career because they, the things they wanted me to do with my arms, I, the picture disappeared. So I quit even thinking about it. Well, this last 10, 15 years, the picture comes back. Why? Because I'm doing what I did when I was 18. And here's the picture. You got that yellow stick there? Now, from my eyes, I get set up, take the club back. When I get to the top of my swing, it looks to me like my left arm is parallel to that stick. Okay. Now it isn't, if you stand behind me, right. it's angled a little bit. But then here's the rest of the picture. So I see this, and then I get right here, and then as this goes up, it looks like my left arm is parallel to that stick. Mm -hmm. And when I start down, it looks like my arm angles into the stick. This way, yeah. yeah. And that's really, that. what that is, is it's this arm internally or externally yeah. rotating. Mm -hmm. But I see my arm parallel, and then my arm, my arm goes parallel to the stick, inside the stick. Yeah. So, just for the hell of it, look at that stick. Make a backswing where you feel like that the, uh, when you get there, that's your left arm and it goes up to this all the way up. And it looks like it's parallel to the stick. Mm -hmm. Then angle it in and it comes that, that perfect. Now you see that picture of your left arm. Yeah. Okay, go ahead and do that slow and just chip the ball out there 50 yards and make your arm be parallel to the stick angled inside the stick don't even worry about the rest of it and hit it just like that that's perfect oh good okay. you're still working out <laughs> yeah freaking he's got the that show? he's got the guns going that's that's my non-golf activity well that's all right you need this stress reliever too there it's you see it looks parallel then it looks angled yeah. so your arm goes parallel angled hit just like that. That's perfect. That's oh, now that's a ten. Yeah. <laughs> Do that again. I, I mean, the, the reason you hit to the inside is see you're so used to not quite being there, and you're used to your arms being a little behind you and something pushing yeah. your hands out. Well, all of a sudden it did. Good. Good. There you go. Okay, good. Let's go ahead and ship it like that. That's really good. Really good. Hey Mike, how long are you guys gonna be here? Can I can I run to the restroom? Yeah, yeah, just take that cart. And go back to the You gotta go back, it's the only place there is one. Okay, yeah, sorry. Good. There you go. Good, 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 good. For me, I mean, that's this, like I say, when I started, that's boom, boom. I mean, I just saw that every time I hit a ball. Yeah. So I'd get on the, in a tournament, I'd stand there and I'd see my left arm parallel and then go, I mean, it just was something, a picture I saw all the time. And when they started getting me to keep my arm against my side, open the club face, and all of a sudden this arm wasn't in the same place. And they said, well, that's perfect. So I discounted the picture. And then as I kind of more fouled, a sudden, I don't know, a little while ago, it was actually a few months ago. I'm out here hitting balls and I had my video on. And I'm watching, I still didn't like where my arms were going back. And all of a sudden I made a couple of, and I, it was like, it's one of those aha moments. Yeah, right. Where I went, and as soon as I went here, all of a sudden my brain went, oh, I've seen that. Thing yeah, before. right. And I went, oh, okay, I kept doing it. So, that's a good picture to give your brain because then it's, here's where my left arm, so all of a sudden, this doesn't work. Yeah, right. So all of a sudden it wants to get, because it wants the picture to look like, now the reason it, it's not parallel is because your eyes are on this side of your arm. So it looks parallel, but this arm, even at the top, is slightly angled. Oh yeah, I mean your, 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 your chest and your hips are moving, so it's gonna push it that way. And yeah. That, I mean, that's, that's, how your, that's how your arm gets this way at all. It's not me pushing it against my chest. That's right. So all of this, hold this against your chest, yeah. has killed people. Mm -hmm. And your arm actually, once you get here and your shoulders are turned, here's yeah. what should happen. Your arm should then just go up and down. Yeah. It should go up your chest. 
Now the reason it angles is because your lower body moves. Mm -hmm. So when your lower body moves, it tilts your spine angle and that drops you. That's what shallows your arms is what your lower body okay. does. Mm -hmm. um, but you were much better, but you got right here and it still was wanting to pull around yeah. you just a little bit. Mm -hmm. So when it does that, then it's going to go this way a little and then yeah. we've got some of that. Yeah. Now, 